Hello everybody. Welcome to part two of cleaning and organizing the garage. So now as you see here, couple shelves, couple shelves empty. And then up higher, since I have a lot of boxes and things up there, and I'm basically one-handed here, the best thing to do is start placing things in a better order instead of trying to lift all these boxes. Okay, so from right here, I have my oils, I have my different clean things, different bottles, and up here, tire shine. So what I think I'm gonna do is start placing all similar items into one area. So let's do that. Got up here, a whole bunch of different bottles, tire shine, on foam, and all these different things. Glass cleaner, index, for breeze. About empty, but keep it there. Here you got a water bottle, kitchen pile. Um, let's see here. Got some raid and fogger shot in here. Pot shot. Got some more over here. Oh, oh, I'm dropping stuff. All right, all right. Got some Roundup. Maybe that's trash pile. I'm hearing that's not good for the health. Roundup. Uh, let's see. Pumping clean. Got some rags. I think that's a, like a plastic box lever to clamp the lid down. Put this in the mommy pile. Large pile. Hope these camera angles are good, because man, oh man. This one-handed thing is wild. Okay, got a lint roller. You can see the marks there. Dogs. So... It's it's still good actually. It has a lot on it, a lot of tabs and things on it. So we'll put this in this pile, the mommy slash home pile. Got some can in. Power clean. I'm gonna set that here. Along with all these different bottles. <laughs> Right, another brush head, or another broom head. Ooh. We got a brush. Ooh, yeah, brush. Got some caulk. And let's see, what else? What else can we put down? Oh, another tube of stuff. Some Duron. Tile stuff. Okay. So, in this... In this shelf here, we have a lot of different cleaning and oils. And different products there. Then up here. Another one, almost empty, but we're gonna set it here. Okay, so I think that that's about all the different bottles of cleaners and things right there. Once again, up here, have a lot of different things. 
Wow. What is this? So much stuff. And here we go. I think that's for to help the de-icers and things. So we're gonna set that in here. We set it over here. Hot pot. We're gonna set the 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 hot pot. In the kitchen stuff, of course. As I'm going in with my little song there. It's gonna be on iTunes. <laughs> Got another, oh. This is like a leather rag. You see, you take it and wipe the car down once you drench it in water. But within it is another rag. Oh! <laughs> Sit in the garage pile. All right, so a lot of these other things, a lot of this heavy stuff, I think I'm gonna take and put on the bottom shelves. Because all the things I would need I need to place them where I can get them and grab them easily. Because I'm not sure if all that stuff should go in the house. Or thrown out. So organize the best I can given what I have. Towel. Throw that in the home pile. Let's see. Of course, shark vacuum. Home pile. Multi-purpose vinyl gloves in a little basket. Little basket. Okay. So set that in the home pile. So what we got here now. Alright, so moving over this way. Ooh, a dust bin. Collecting your dust. Okay. I'm gonna put that in the garage pile. And what do we got here? Some ease repair, screen door repair. We have a screen door, we only have one. So, eh, garage pile, might as well. Who knows, maybe I can repair someone's screen door. All right, so up here. Got another, or is it the same manual jack? No, this is a this is a different manual jack. Holy crud! Not sure what this one's to, but garage pile. Ooh, oh, oh. Another hose. I think that's to that steamer. We put it over there. All right, all right. Got a, I think another plastic lid clamp for a plastic box. We put that over here. Ooh, organizing is very necessary because if you can't find your stuff, bad day. So let's continue. Got a lid, trash pile. bag here, different wood pieces, when I was building my dog house, uh, I guess trash pile, these are too small to cut or screw anything in, oh I guess unless you make a pilot hole, so maybe not, maybe those aren't trash, um, let's see, so now we got paint, waterproof sealer, Instructions for the lawnmower. We've got some tapes over here. Set that in this pile. In a minute here, we're gonna have to start replacing things. Just need to make sure I get all I need off of these shelves. Keep you covered. Keep yourself covered. Um. I don't know how old this is, so whatever's in there may not matter. 
Let's see. The candle rack. I need a candle rack. But home pile. So one thing I don't like is not being able to find things when I need them. Oh, this like that. It looks like a storage bag type of deal for a, a cooler home pile. All right, all right, all right, all right. Looks like a snippet or something, so trash pile. Another wooden block from that bag. So once again, it's in the trash pile for now, but I think I may come back. You never know when you can use a little bit of good wood, right? Lawnmower motor unit, along with the instructions there for the lawnmower. So I'm gonna set these. On top, of the toolbox. <laughs> Took me a second there. McGuire Nicholas. I think this is like a holster for something. Maybe a brush or a tool, maybe like a big hammer. It looks like a slot for a hammer. You got the slots there for the stick to come through, so garage pile. And we got premium leather here, house pile. Oh, it fell over. And we got our paint here. Waterproofing paint. So, um, our, my painting section is up here, which can pillow, which could use a little more, not so more, a little more organization, but once again, there's very little space, and I don't even think the paint can fit up there. Plastic piece, I that's to like a, a car or something. So far, we got two floor jacks, one from a Toyota and one from something else. Don't know what those are for. It's all right. Paint. Paint clean. So let's see, see what I can do in organizing this. Oh, there's that coil brush that the tag came off of. I'm not really sure what you use it for, but keep it there for now. So then got paint cleanup. Oh, here's the red paint. It came from that piece of plastic. So I'm gonna leave that up there. And that paint can won't fit within those slot within that type of slot. So that's right. Let's see. It's like a sander. Heavy duty universal sander. For all heavy duty sanding. Let's sand it down. So okay, once again, let's see. So I got paint trays over here, and here's a new paint tray. So what I'm gonna do is take these things, set it on this shelf, and then I'm gonna move this other paint tray over. Let's see, I really hope I'm getting good with these camera angles. More paint rollers, set them down here. Scoot that over. Paint roller. All right, let's see. And then we got paint rollers up there. Little roll for the paint roller. Paint brushes. That there. Scraper. I guess that can go in the painting section. 
We're over here. More paint roller, or paint roller and some more brushes. All right, painting, painting, painting. Looks like I'm gonna have to be doing a lot of that. We got the painting, gloves, and a spreader. Carpentry spreader, I guess. Set that up here next to the scraper. And the hand sander, we'll put that up here with that too. Another brush, and I believe this is some kind of painting tool, but I don't, I don't really know. So, gonna put that right in there. And the paint, we're just gonna push it back right here, because it won't fit right there. Okay, so we got our paint section. We got our paint section, and up here, got plastic. Not even sure. Maybe this is a laundry. Maybe I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Another one for the home pile. And we've got this wire. Oh, something else up here. Oh yeah. Piece of a desk. I'm gonna be desking things. <laughs> All right, put that in the garage pile. And let's see what else we got up here. Let's, let's see if this cord moves over. Success. So now we moved our cord over. We got plenty of space on this rack. Um, Let's see. What else could I move and put up here? Hmm. Well, don't know that yet, but we got more painting supplies. Ooh, more paint rollers and some cups. Man, that's some cups for some car. Hmm. Got cups though, or cup holders. Cup holders. There you go. Paint rack. Painters. <laughs> paint rollers, paint rollers, paint rollers. Lay them down. All right, all right. So up there, got a oh, turkey fryer. Some ads. This is my mom's old car. Maybe that's what that is. Maybe that's what those couple are to for my mom's old car. Once again, got some plastic to lay down when you paint. We got a space up there. So, what can we put up there? Hmm, I don't know. But now, got a rack. A little bit of table right there. Another cup. Like a beach chair. We'll get back there later. Oh man, got a lot of organizing to do. All right, um. So now let's see, let's see, let's see. What can we put over here? Put over here. Since this space here has a large gap, we can put some tall items up there. Tall items. Hmm. Don't have many of those. A lot of stuff and we have a lot of bottom rows clear. So, what I think I'm gonna do, since we have a trash pile, we got our garage pile, we got our miscellaneous, and we got the home pile. Let's see, how do I want to do this? I think we're going to take the garage pile and put all of this over here. <laughs> More conducive with the garage type stuff along the side. And then some of the stuff I'm not going to take inside. I'm gonna put towards the front over here. Over here. All right, so let's get at it. First thing, I think I'm gonna go for, mm, 
I'm gonna go for the floor or, or the dog here. Let's see, let's sit this right in here. Oh, we got stuff in there. Let me get one of my brushes I found. See, cleaning up is a good thing. Let's see. Let's see. Time for the tiny dustpan. <laughs> tiny dustpan. Okay, let's see here. We got our dirt. So let's sweep it. <laughs> it works. Tiny dustpan for the win. Since the lawnmower bag here is collapsible, we'll place this in here and then set the little dolly on top. Can collapse it there. Whoop. More stuff to clean. There we go. That seemed to work. All right, what's next? We got that there. Let's see what else we can place in there. Once again, back at the garage pile here. Then we're gonna take this and set it here. Or maybe not, because it comes out there. I'm gonna scratch the car. Set that over there. Next, I'm gonna get the fan here. Put that over there. Or over here. Right, because I'm coming over here. It was over there. Or. Move it over there. Spatial awareness. Okay. Uh, let's see what else can I put over there. Oh, the floor jacks. The floor jacks. Mm. All right. Floor jack to the Toyota. The floor jack to the I don't know. Oh man, that one's long. That's all right. Got that in there. So we got all of that in there. I got the fan shroud housing. All right, what else we got? What can we put over there from the garage pile? Ooh, this little step stool. Little foldable step stool. Oh, I dropped it. Never drop your stool. Let <laughs> me set this better. Oh, okay. Well, I know where it is. And there it is. And here from the garage pile. That may be it. I 
that may be it for that. Or, let's see. Oh, let me get this piece. Yes. All right, and my little tile here. Here we are. Okay, we'll take it. Set it there. Got our tile. What else can I set over there? That may be it. That may be it. Okay, okay, okay. So the last little bit that we have for the garage pile. I think I'm gonna set under my little rack where I have all of my different products and oils and stuff. So I'm gonna take the extension cord. Oh, knock something over. Oh, that was gonna go on top. Extension cord. Well, I'm gonna get this can I knocked over. There we go. Got that in there. I'm gonna take my little locker rack here. See if it'll fit. Oh, there we go. There we go. Set that in there. These pieces here, I think I'm gonna set this over here. Take them, set them back over there. All these different odd shapes and things. Hard to quite put in a proper order. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take my little east right there. Set it right there. We got here. I got um, my funnel. Let's see this box here. Get the funnel out. Get the funnel out. And set it right here. And then these, I think I'm going to just sit back up here. Those other parts. All right. So now. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna set it up here with the paint. Set it like that. Face that this way so I can see what it is next time. Oh, see that? There it is. Then now for my brushes and things. One here, one here, and one here. I'm gonna set them right over here. Next to the scraper and my brushes. And then while I'm thinking about it, from when I washed my car, look in here. Yeah. We put these over here too, so now I know where my soap is. And even my little washer thingy. Set them right there. Um, let's see. Oh, another brush. And this little head of a broom. Set it over here with the brushes. This one, right next one. There we go. There we are. Got my rags. One, two, three. Oh, four. And I got my little leather rag thing. My little other rag here. 
Um, we're gonna sit them right here. Just right on top, and we'll get back to those a little bit later. And then here, and then this little piece. And then, water drain. I'm gonna sit the water drain over here. And this right there. And then my little plastic piece. I'm gonna also just sit right here. And then I got a dustpan, dustpan, dustpan. I'm gonna sit that right on top of my little easy step. Easy fold. The stepper thing there. And I got another brush head, a broom head. I think I'm gonna set the broom heads down here. Put my little mini dust pan right there. I guess I'll sit that on top there. And then here's my other little brush, or my other little broom head, sit it right there. <clears throat> we got our little holster here, I guess, for a hammer. I'm gonna sit this here over here with the paint and my screen repair kit. You know, for the times you repair your screen. And this thing here to the beach. Let's set this back over here. All right. Set it right there for now. This has been part two. Thank you for watching. As you can see, we have some better organization, but we got to keep working. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.